Okay, so today I'm going to teach you how to um, how to chop and flip samples, and um, I'm working with these beats. And it's just the, the the like I just started with the drums, but I want to chop the samples so that you see how I I, I chop my samples, I flip my samples. So I'll be working with a guitar loop, which sounds like. So that's how the guitar loop sound. So um, um, what what I'll do is I'll drag the guitar. I'll open slice X. And what I normally do is I drag the guitar. So I drag the guitar to the slice X. Then I'll be working from there. So after dragging it in, what I do is. What I do is I come to slice X then with the marker I I put them in front of exactly where the sample hits so that I can manipulate it anyhow I want. You can as you can see this sample is uh, 103 BPM and my BPM I'm working with is 150. So in order for it to fit the 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 distance um for it to fit the tempo you just have to you know put the marker at the beginning of where the sample hits so that's what i'm doing uh, okay some some are even at the beginning of where the sample hits So that's it. I'm done with the with the chopping of the sample. This is also chopping of samples. So I'm now coming to play with it. I'm now coming to make my uh, a different melody from the guitar melody. So I'll put the metronome on to time how the sample how I'll flip the sample. So let's go. So I'm done. I'm done chopping the first part. Then I'll I'll shoot it. I'll copy and paste it at the other side of the. So that I'll get um, four bars, but I'll manipulate that one too. So I'm, I'm okay with this one. I'm okay with how this one is sounding. So what I'll do next is I'll play it with the drums to see how it's sounding. So it's okay. It's sounding cool. So what I do next is for 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 other uh, in order to like get variation of the sample 
I open another slice X. But this time, what I do is I, I pitch it up higher. Then, so that, so, so this is how it will sound when it's pitched higher. So, I'll cut some of it out. Then I'll place a delay on it so that it will fill the spaces. Thank you.